everyone. My name is Yuli of Yuli's Boutique and this is a brief tutorial on how to start your very own online business. Now I'm borrowing my husband's office here <laughs> so we're not in the boutique today but there's just a few points that I wanted to share with you. There's a number of questions that we seem to receive. So before we begin I'd like to strongly suggest that you set up a PayPal account. This is absolutely necessary. This will allow you to accept payments from customers via PayPal, and you can have those funds either directly deposited into your bank account, or they can remain on your PayPal business card for use. And there's just so many advantages to having a PayPal account. We, I simply can't list them all, but I strongly suggest you start there. Now, to get your online business going, you'll need a few things. What you'll need first is a product or a service. Decide what you're selling. You know, whether it's a service that you provide, such as a baker or a seamstress or a hairdresser, whatever it may be, or whether you're selling actual products, uh, clothing, shoes, accessories, you need to find out what your product is. The second thing you need is a business name. Decide on a name for your online business. Um, this should be a name that's easy for customers to remember, but it should also be a name that resonates what your business is really about. The third thing you'll need is a platform. You have to choose a platform. And there are so many free platforms out there that you don't have to use a lot of money. Take advantage of those free platforms. Um, there's a lot of freebies to help you get your business going um, before jumping onto a paying platform. Um, a few suggestions are uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Brisk Sale, LinkedIn, Pinterest, there's so many avenues available that are free and that can help get you going. And each of these platforms um, are currently being used by many businesses to promote their services or products now. And some of these products allow you to sell directly from the pro platform itself. So that's great. Now, an additional platform that I absolutely love is called Spreesy. S-P-R-E-E-S-Y dot com. Now this platform can serve as a storefront for your business. Uh, it's an amazing tool because it integrates with your Facebook, with your Instagram, with your Twitter, with your Pinterest accounts. It integrates everything right there together. So when you post an item for sale on Spreezy, you can automatically post the item on your social media pages simultaneously. It saves a lot of time. Um, there's no contracts, there's no commitments with Spreezy. Um, you make a sale and Spreezy takes a very small percentage of that sale. And that's how you pay them, that's how they make their money. But every Spreezy seller is automatically set up with an e-commerce store. And these stores will allow your customers to purchase products from any device. Um, so though I do have my main website, which is uh, www. Yuli'sBoutique.com. I also have a Spreezy website that I use as well, and that is www.spreezy.com backslash Yuli's Boutique. So I use both of them. Now, another platform that I love is Square. This is a wonderful platform for anyone starting an online business. Um, not only does Square serve as a credit card processing center for your business, but it also allows you to create a free, F-R-E-E, -E, free <laughs> business website where customers can directly purchase your items. I love Square. Um, I use it for my online business, and my um, Square page is yulisboutique.com. So if you go to www.yulisboutique.com, boutique.com which is u-y-l-e-e -E, boutique.com you can see my square page um, the sixth thing I would advise is to take advantage of selling apps if you're selling products never underestimate these selling apps the, the power of these apps are amazing and I use them faithfully um, there are some great apps out there that allow you to sell directly on their site and they assist you with shipping um, they give you tips and provide buyer and seller protection. Um, and these sites are online, but you can also download apps onto your smartphone or tablet. Um, the 
apps that I enjoy to use to sell my products are Poshmark, Poshmark.com. I also use Tradesy, Tradesy.com, uh, Mercury.com, and Depop.com. And I also use eBay.com. I love these sites. There's no upfront fees. There's no contact, no contracts to use these platforms. And as with the other sites, um, a percentage, a small percentage is taken from each sale at the end of it. And that's how you pay for the use of these sites. But it's such a small percentage that you don't notice it. And all of these sites are online. So there's no meeting customers in person, you know, to set up any um, physical shops or anything. So the final word is um, there are many, many other great ways to start your online business. This is simply the route that we chose and it's worked for us wonderfully. I enjoy it. But we're constantly making adjustments, we're constantly making changes, and we're constantly trying to improve. So remember, if one platform isn't working for you, try another. You will learn what works best for you through trying various avenues. So enjoy. Until next time, this is Yuli of Yuli's Boutique. If you'd like to contact me, I'm at www.yulisboutique.com or you can email me directly at yuli at yulisboutique.com. Have a 